Hello guys, this is Fabiola and today I want to show you how to make um, we're gonna make a little um, accordion style um, recipe um, it can be like a, fold, a little folder or something like that a little box to to put your favorite recipes um, recipes I mean <laughs> and whatnot and um, we're gonna be using one little dreamers uh, all about food set and you're also gonna need some envelopes and I'm gonna tell you what you need while we're making it okay um, I use 12 envelopes these regular envelopes you can use any envelopes you want but since the paper I'm using is this one so I wanted to coordinate but you can use whatever envelopes you you want okay um, so what you need I use 12 of them because I'm gonna do like breakfast, lunch, dinner, and dessert. And I use like three pockets for breakfast, three for lunch, three for dinner, and three for, for dessert. So I, I use 12 envelopes. And your envelopes are gonna be your pockets. So um, it's easier that way. So all you have to do, um, you're gonna open your envelope and you're gonna go ahead and um, glue it down I do that with this with two of them you're gonna do the same thing with all the envelopes that you're gonna um, use I am gonna give you measurements with 12 envelopes okay so keep that in mind when if you want to make it So we do that and then just I love this dressing so to give it a little um, dimension and whatnot you're gonna um, I'm just gonna ink my sides all the sides okay of both envelopes here you're gonna do that with your all the envelopes that you're gonna use I'm using 12 so I did that with all 12 envelopes and after you've done that you're gonna get your paper trimmer and you're gonna trim just a little bit just to open it to make your pocket okay so you're just gonna trim just a tiny bit in the opposite side of the side that you glue okay so we're gonna head and do that so it's just that tiny bit see just a little bit so now you have a pocket there see so I'm gonna do that with my other envelope okay once you have them both open like this you are gonna glue them together not all the the envelope okay you're just gonna add glue like from about one and a half inch down okay to the side that you glue before so you're gonna add some glue like so and you're gonna glue both envelopes together okay like this so we're gonna go ahead and do that just a, a little bit of glue make sure that the openings are on the same side okay and we're gonna glue them together like so and you're gonna let them dry you're gonna do this with all the envelopes that you're gonna use I already uh, done that just for video purposes to save some time but you're gonna do that with all the envelopes that you want to use okay so I'm gonna wait just a little bit until is um, blue okay now we're gonna create some sort of like an accordion style between these two so you're gonna have not just two pockets but you're gonna have this pocket another pocket here between the two envelopes a small pocket remember because we glue that down so you can 
um, insert like a small card there and then here okay so you're gonna have plenty of pockets to put all the recipes that that you want maybe you're just your favorite recipes okay so you're gonna need a little piece of paper that measures one and a half by two and five eighths okay you can use any paper to coordinate with your other papers but I am gonna use this I just cut like three strips of paper and I cut 22 of these because I'm using 12 envelopes okay so I needed 11 in on each side okay so once you have cut your um, piece of paper you're gonna score your paper at three-eighths of an inch five-eighths of an inch then at one inch and one-eighth and that's it so you're not gonna have you're gonna end up with four little sides and um, uh, four, four divisions here and three score lines and you're gonna wanna create type of an M okay like so like if you're gonna make a fan a little fan you know and for each one you're gonna glue it you're gonna add some glue on this side and this side and glue it all the way here okay oh. <clears throat> so we're gonna go ahead and do that I'm gonna add some glue to both my sides this side and this side I'm gonna close it here and I'm gonna come here and oh! <laughs> sorry guys and insert that here And there. I'm gonna hold it there for a minute. And if it, you have a little, just cut it and nothing happened. <laughs> so now you have that side, and you're gonna repeat that same process on this side, okay? In all the envelopes, okay? Between the two, between two envelopes, okay? So you have one envelope here another little pocket there and another envelope here so you're gonna have that for video purposes I already done that so here it is I have it all this stress on my sides and I have all the papers glued down so I have a little accordion style um, file or whatever you want to call it so um, now we're gonna go ahead and um make our um cover this okay so we we're gonna have like a little folder okay so here, to okay? cover this um uh, accordion we are gonna need a piece of paper that measures um five and three quarters by twelve and you're gonna wanna go ahead and score it at two i already um score my paper but you want to go ahead and score it at two two and three quarters seven and one quarter and seven and, and five five eighths after you have scored all that you're gonna go ahead and fold make sure your folds are crisp that's why I use my um, 
my bomb folder. Sorry, guys. <coughs> and then here again. And here. Okay, now I have all my sides score and folded the way I want it to be. So this is gonna be this way. Okay. So I um <clears throat> now that you have this all the way, I am gonna go ahead and ink my edges I am using a uh, distress ink vintage photo for this and what I really like to do is that on these folds I am also going to add some distress ink much just subtle and once we have done that we're gonna go ahead and add some glue on this side uh, make sure that you leave this uh, space here without glue and this little one here without glue I'm sorry guys here my glue is acting Silly, wanting to cooperate with me. <laughs> That's enough glue. <clears throat> so we're gonna go ahead and glue this down. Make sure that um, you align this well. So, and I am going to tell you for my inserts, uh, you need four inserts and this measure five and three eighths by three and seven eighths. Okay, you're gonna need four of those if you want to do breakfast, lunch, dinner, and dessert. Okay, and for these ones. I cut these ones with my cameo, but you can easily just cut a, a rectangle and round your corners with a corner punch or just leave them like that. I mean, it's up to you. And um, I'm going to go ahead and distress my edges. Okay, so now that that's done, we are going to need some... Um, like a little tab to put here um, you can use uh, any punch um, I have like this punch and the curly label one and another one but my stamps don't fit well I, I it just looks ugly I don't know I didn't like it so what I did was cut these little ones with my cameo but once again you can cut them by hand and these ones measure two and a quarter by two okay and what we're gonna do is that we're gonna go ahead and fold this this baby we're gonna fold it in half like so get my bomb folder here make sure my edge is crisp and nice and once I've done that, I already have my four, three of them ready. And this little edge, we are gonna um, do it with this one, okay? You can also use like any type of punch you have, or if you wanna just leave it like this, you 
can go ahead and do that is up to you but I love scallop things so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you how I did it thank you Pinterest because I think I saw something like this on Pinterest but it was I think it was with a little tag but um, let me there we go that's good there see you have your scallop there and then um, the other side I'm gonna do just the same and then we are going to um, I just have to put it on this side because I can't see there then we're gonna go ahead and distress our edges I just want to make sure I'm doing it right there we go and then we go and then just distress okay now that we have this done we um, want to do it we want to position our little tab so we can see it when we are here we can see one like here another 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 so you don't want them all going the same um, side so what I am going to do is put my um, my little inserts like this and this can be here and this one there this one there and my last one can be there because it's not gonna be so close to my to my first one so I'm gonna go ahead and glue this before I stamp so that's how we're gonna do it and now we're gonna use our stamps <coughs> and start stamping we are gonna be using this set is a all about food and it's one little dreamer okay so we're gonna use the breakfast lunch dinner and dessert okay so we're gonna go ahead and do that Now that we have stamped all of these, you can put them, let's say, breakfast. You can insert in your first pocket like so. See? And then you're going to insert your uh, lunch, dinner, and dessert, or the, any way you want it, really. So now, I think that's good. Maybe I thought I should do it like a little opening here but I think it looks nice this way so I'm gonna take this out for a minute and I'm gonna add some glue here remember it's not necessary for you to add glue at the bottom but it's up to you if you want to do it that's just fine it's not gonna make really a difference on your project so we're gonna add some glue here and glue this down I get so nervous when I glue stuff down because I don't want to be all messed up <laughs> so here we go I think it looks nice and now we have this close in here that you can add um, velcro maybe here I completely forgot to pick up velcro <laughs> to do it but I am going to go ahead and embellish my little um, boxy thing, my recipe um, accordion for. I'm going to um, embellish it and come back to you to tell you how I did it. Okay, guys, I am back. Um, I didn't add much embellishments. I actually um, bought... A set of kitchen stickers and I just added that and since I don't have my velcro that I needed to buy but I forgot um, I 
think the dress work out perfect there because you, she can open it like so and then um, just close it right back it had a little foam um, pop-up dot behind here but I took it off so she can do that and then I added um, this border with the same paper that I did my accordion um, I added that border with my uh, this stamping up punch and I then added this little pie that it came with this set uh, it is from the uh, paperhouseproductions.com you can get these stickers if you want them and the little uh, measuring spoons and then I use one more sentiment from the um, all about food set cooking up a storm so I use that one to put it there and then the little spoons I added some uh, bling there some red bling to go with the dress and the um, apron didn't come with this it just came with the little belt but then I, I went ahead and added some bling there and of course I had to add a doily because I am in love with doilies so I added that so that's my project guys I hope you like it I hope that um, you can make your own and if you have any questions just uh, let me know thank you guys bye, -bye.